Okay, so today we're going to have our first saxophone lesson. So let's go ahead and start by opening the case and assembling the instrument. So make sure the symbol's on top of the case. Go ahead and flip the latches up. And go ahead and lift the case. Good, so the first thing that I want you to do is take out the neck of the instrument. Good. And then also grab out the mouthpiece. Good, what you're going to do is pull the case off of the mouthpiece and go ahead and set that back in your case. Now you're going to want to put the mouthpiece onto the neck of the saxophone by simply just sliding it on. You're going to want to cover up most of your cork. Good. Now go ahead and put your ligature on, which is this gold piece, but the screws to the right. Good. Now your mouthpiece should be lined up so that the opening part where your reed goes is right in line. Can I see? Good. Perfect. So now what I'm going to do is go ahead and grab out your reed. And just soak it in your mouth a little bit. Good. Now go ahead and take it out. And what you're going to do is leaving the ligature on. The ligature always goes on first. Place the reed under it, flat against the mouthpiece. Good. Now, the tip of the reed should be slightly below the tip of the mouthpiece, like this, so you should see a little bit of black. Can you see? Can you tilt it towards me? It's a little far down, so you want to push up using the thumb and the pointer finger. Slide the reed up so it's, if you look at mine, slightly below the black. Good. Now push the ligature down, if it's not already, and tighten the screws. Good. Now what I want you to do is go ahead and set this back down in your case. And what we're going to do is pull the actual saxophone out. So I want you to take your right hand and put it over here, and your left hand over here, and lift it straight up out of the case. Go ahead and set it on your lap. Also, grab your neck strap. Oh. This is going to go on over your head, like so. Good. Now take the little hook on the back of the neck strap and hook it in the circle on the back of your saxophone. and just twist it on. Good. Okay, so let me just see how this is. Good, yes, this should all be in line so that it's straight. Now that your mouthpiece is on correctly, go ahead and tighten the screw. instruments put together, we're going to talk a little bit about posture. So what I want you to do is come and sit up right on the front of your chair. Let's actually move our cases as well. Just go ahead and slide it off to the side and close it. Good. So what I want you to do is sit up nice and tall on the end of your chair, both of your feet flat on the floor. Good. Back nice and straight. Very good. So now that we have our same posture, we're going to keep this and we're going to add the, we're going to learn how to hold the instrument. Okay, so starting with the left hand, your thumb is going to go on this black thumb rest. Your pointer finger is going to go on this white key right here. The second one. Middle finger, ring finger. And then these are called spatch keys on the side. Your pinky is just going to kind of rest on them for now. You, what you want your left hand to be like is a C. A nice C shape with the fingers angled downward. So if you look at mine, Relaxed C shape, fingers, fingers angled downward. Good. Now, with the left hand, your thumb is going to hook in this thumb rest back here. Good. And hold the saxophone out so that it's not in between your legs. Good. And then 
Point your finger on the top, white key, middle finger on the middle one, ring finger on the third one, and then these pinkies down on these keys as well. Good. So now as we're holding the saxophone, I want you to go ahead and just put the ring in your mouth and hold it out in front of you so that you have a nice strong posture. Good. Now your arms are kind of in towards you. Just kind of bring them out just a little bit. There you go. And actually what I need to adjust your mouth, oh, your, um, the neck of your instrument a little. It's a little twisted. We feel how this is more straight now. Good. So going back to your finger positions, your left hand fingers are just going, or your right hand fingers, sorry, are going to come straight onto the keys. They're not on any kind of downward angle. And so let's just practice holding an instrument a few times. Gonna put it in your mouth. Good. Now let's go ahead and bring it down to our lap. Good. Now let's go over what we just did. Go ahead and grab the instrument correctly with your fingers in the right places. And when you're ready, bring it up to a proper playing position. Very good job. Okay, so now what I want us to do is talk a little bit about breath support. This is going to be a very important part of making your first sounds. Okay, so as you breathe, you can go ahead and relax your saxophone. Go ahead and bring it to the other side. There you go. And you can just kind of hold on to it a little bit. What I want you to do is when you're taking a breath, you need to breathe down deep into your lungs without raising your shoulders or changing anything with your body. So let's just try that once. We're going to breathe in for four counts. I'm going to count you in. I'll give you four. Just take a nice deep breath without changing anything on your body. One, two, ready, now. Good, so what I just saw was your body like this. Everything tightened. Okay, just keep everything relaxed. You don't move your body as you breathe. Try it again. I'll count you in for four, then we'll breathe. One, two, ready, breathe. Yeah, much better. Go ahead and let that breath out. So now, just as important with breath support is how you breathe this air out. Nothing should change as well. Okay, so what I want you to do this time is place your hand in front of your face. We're going to breathe in for four and breathe out for four. I would like to see, like you to feel a constant airstream on your hand as you breathe out. Okay? So one, two, breathe in. Good. What I would like us to try this time is we're going to do the same thing we just did, and you're going to hold this piece of paper in front of you. Okay? So I'm going to give you one of these. I want us to breathe in for four, and as we breathe out for four, what should happen is your breath should hold the paper in the same position. So watch once. Do you see how my air held the paper out? I want us to try that together. So we're going to breathe in together for four, out for four, holding the paper. So make sure you're blowing right at the page. One, two, breathe in. So what we're going to do now is we are going to talk a little bit about um, what your mouth looks like while you're breathing with that same support that we just used. Okay, so make sure your posture is staying up. Go ahead and lift your saxophone. Okay, and you're just going to put it in your mouth, just maybe about a half of an inch. Okay, good. Now what I should see is the corners of your lips should go back, almost tighten like the spokes of a wheel. I shouldn't see as much flush and lip as I see. If you go ahead and watch me, I put it in, and I bring my corners back a little bit to tighten them, and you don't really see all of this flushy pink of my lips. So go ahead and look at mine, and then bring your corners back just a little bit. Think of saying we, we. And the feeling that you get in your mouth when you say we to pull your corners back. Good, that's much better. So now what you also want to think about is that the black part on the top of the mouthpiece should be touching the bottom of your teeth. Okay? Good. Let me see. Good. I would also 
I'd like you to sit up a little bit more. Push your saxophone up just a little bit. Your chin should stay up. It shouldn't fall down. Good. Now, what I want you to think of as you pull your corners back, your chin should be flat. So if you watch mine, my chin flattens as I bring my corners back. Can you try that for me? Yeah, that's much flatter. And inside your mouth, which is called your oral cavity, should be relaxed. So we're going to make sure everything is nice and relaxed. Now we're actually going to try and make a sound, okay? So correct posture that we talked about. We're going to take a nice deep breath like we talked about and then just breathe out with nice breath support like we did with the paper and try and make a sound. So let's go ahead and get our mama shirt ready. You're going to breathe in through the corners of your mouth. and just play together. Yeah, that's not bad for your first sound. So now what we're going to talk about is how exactly we are going to tongue, which is considered articulation, while making the same sound that we just made. Okay, so what you're going to do is the tip of your tongue should be touching the tip of the reed. So let's go ahead and take the saxophone down and let's just do a little bit of tonguing. Okay, I want you to think of forming the same embouchure, which is your mouth, that we just did. And a couple of times I want you to say, two, two, two. Try that. Two, two, two. Good. Your first two, your tongue came out of your lips. What we want to do is make sure that we're touching right behind the teeth. Your tongue should never come out. Two, two, two. Two, two, two. Now this time I want you to say, foo, foo, foo. What happened to your tongue when you said foo that was different from saying to? Came through. Yeah, it came through your teeth. Foo is incorrect. Say that. Foo is incorrect. Good, so let's say two, foo, two. Two, foo, two. So we feel the difference there? Good, so two is how this you want to articulate. Okay, so um, let's go ahead and put the saxophone back up to our mouth. Um, about a fourth to a half of an inch from the tip of your tongue is where you're going to be tonguing, okay? Let's actually say da as we tongue this time so we can get a nice, clear articulation, okay? So just taking a deep breath, now I'm going to say da as you blow through the reed. Listen once. I just want you to relax your body and relax your oral cavity. Your mouth is very tightly squeezed around the reed and it shouldn't be as tight as it is. So let's try it again. I'm going to put the saxophone up, take a nice deep breath, and blow up. Saying da. Yeah, much better. Did you hear how much clearer your sound was when you relaxed? Let's go ahead and try that one more time. Let's play together. Listen to my sound first and try and match it. Play one note together. Say no. Breathe in. Good. So the main thing that I want you to focus on, we're going to play one more note, is just relaxing your body as well as your mouth. Everything up here appears to be very tense to me. So just relax that. Okay, let's go ahead one more time and try to make a sound using good posture, nice air support. Very good job. So that is it for our first saxophone lesson. Very good job.